is going on you guys what's up glam girl squad it's your girl and hope you're having a bomb day if you're new or what's up first of all we have so many things to talk about and i'm gonna be talking pretty fast i'm gonna be talking about a lot of different stuff there's just so much going on first of all elephant in the room my hair is brown. I'm doing a lace wig series for my girls that want to learn how to color their hair. So that's the first one. Second elephant in the room is bitch. We are on lockdown. I wanted to come through and just check in with you guys. Like, how are y'all doing? Wendy Williams voice, how y'all doing? Girl. I would like to state that I am naturally an introverted person, right? I like to work. I love to work, actually. I love to work, especially because I love what I do for work. So as a beauty entrepreneur, I, for the most part, I am working by myself and just doing what I gotta do. The first stage was like, okay, you guys gotta chill at home. Y'all can't be going out like that. So I was, you know, going out. I was was like enjoying some of the vibes but even still for the most part i was still in sight and then the next phase of quarantine happened girl and this is when it got real they were like okay y'all can't even go outside no more what in the world is going on <laughs> And I was like, okay, cool. Like I could do that. But girl, I tried to go to the hair store and the hair store was closed. As of March 24th, they closed at 12 p.m. And girl, I pulled up at 12, 13 and they was like, no. And not to say that the hair store is like, you know, the defining factor of like, you know, the end all be all. But it like really made me see like, no, they're for real. Like you for real should not be outside. The moment when you tell me that I don't even have a choice, I gotta be inside that's when shit kind of gets a little weird and i think that everybody is just in like a weird state right now because this is the first time that this has like happened i don't know what day this is of quarantine i never really counted to begin with but one thing i do know is that the world is just operating in fear right now and i think that it's good to be knowledgeable and know what's going on but i limit how much i can consume the news because that shit really affects me like my brother be like oh you don't watch the news Nigga, no, like I don't because it's, it could be very like depressing. If anything, I'll read the news. I would say consume to your discretion, you know? I was talking to my friend Chantel and she just got this, um, I think it's a Doberman, this new puppy. He's like this black dog and he has like these little cute pointy ears. I was like, I can't wait to meet him. She's like, girl, just let me know when you pulling up. And this was before like everything happened with the quarantine. So I hit her up today and I was like, girl, I don't know when I'm gonna be able to meet Jack. And then she was like, girl, our birthdays are just gonna be to trash. And my birthday is april 28th and the best day of the year this year is my golden year i'm gonna be 20 what 20 you guys say keep saying 20 this year is my golden year so i'm gonna be turning 28 on the 28th yeah i'm gonna be 28 oh my god for some reason i feel like i'm already 28 i've been saying i'm 28 all year this birthday is real special to me because it's also gonna be on a tuesday and i was born on a tuesday so i'm like this is a really bomb birthday what's the vibes gonna be are we gonna be cutting ice cream cake at the crib like in chantel's birthday is cinco de mayo so a week from my birthday and i'm using the this Juvia's palette by the way y'all this color is so pretty I think it's like the perfect transition color so she was saying that our birthdays are not going to be happening and I'm just like what do you mean we don't gonna have no birthday we not gonna have no birthday like what you mean what you mean by that that's another thing y'all i hope on april it's like april fools we were joking y'all could go outside y'all remember when we used to go outside y'all remember going out to eat y'all remember going to concerts y'all remember going shopping in the mall remember that time when we used to go outside <laughs> <laughs> it's not even funny it's like really crazy oh my gosh and i didn't put no primer today because girl where we going like we going to the living room and i'm gonna use derma blend today because after i use air spun in my drugstore hold on she's almost done i have another one but i just like to use all my stuff before i open something else after I used that air spun, I was like, wait, wait, wait. I don't know if it's the air spun that I like or the fact that it's like a lighter kind of color underneath my eye versus the yellow tone. A white setting powder kind of just like reflects and bounce off the light better. You think they're gonna let me into the living room with this white powder? What y'all think? <laughs> I'm about to do my lighting real quick and then I'll come back after my lashes are on. What happens in my lighting? Why do I look so yellow? This is not how I look in real life. Okay, that's good. I am obsessed with this way to line my lips. Now let's do some quick little highlight and then girl, we gonna be good to go. Well, I like to put a little bit of this. This is that Charlotte Tillsbury. I like to put her right underneath like this little part of my eye to really brighten it and highlight it. All of this is for the living room, sis. This is for the living room. Are y'all coming with me to the living room or nah? 
And I just want to also say shout out to everybody in the medical field that's out there putting in that work. Because my mom still got to go to work. Y'all the real superheroes. If nobody has told you, like, I really appreciate you guys because y'all putting in that work. And shout out to everybody that's working to, you know, really just, like, control the situation, coming up with solutions. Shout out to all the scientists that are out there in that lab trying to come up with a solution to this. Because obviously it's something that we did not anticipate. We just got to now work in a way that can just prevent it and do the precautions that we need to do but one thing i do know for sure is that the glam girl squad we are in our bag and we are looking real good and we are feeling good and that's the vibe that i have for this like i'm not about to walk around and be sad and you know really you know let it affect my mood and stuff i'm going to still continue to work and still continue to put out content for you guys so like let me know what y'all want to see y'all i'm using beast Simone detox such a pretty nude. I just want to do a quick little check-in. Let's see how my Glam Girl squad was doing. This is so different for us. So I did want to come and holla at y'all. I do want to also say if I, I said it already, but the microphone was kind of cut off. Shout out to people in the military. Shout out to people that are delivering packages. Be safe. Take your precautions. Make sure you're washing your hands at least for 30 seconds at least. Wear your gloves. If you do have masks, wear your mask. Just really take those um, preventative measures to make sure that the virus is not spread. I want to bless y'all. I will take a moment to just say thank you God for watching over us, protecting us, keeping us safe, opening doors for us that need to be open, close the door that needs to be closed. God be in front of us and protect us and shield us and show us how we can really spread love within each other and connect with each other. We love you. I love y'all. Glam Girl Squad. I do want to let you know that I love you and I just want to thank you guys for um supporting me in every way that you have y'all really are so bomb and um i love y'all so just be safe out there and have fun while you in the living room and still slay period mm. bye